yeah good morning students in this video i will be discussing on the basic characteristics of data communication so the effectiveness of data communication system is mainly depends on four fundamental characteristics but there are many however for simplicity in this video i'm just showing you four characteristics the first one is very important that is delivery so what is delivery so before that first i will list it the second one is accuracy the third one is timeliness and lastly we have jitter so what is that a delivery the system has to deliver data to the correct destination yes. for example whenever a system one is transmitting some data to system two the data should reach to system two only means a destination only it should not uh, uh, deviate or it has to transfer to some other system so the attacker may try to modify the data along with that he will try to change the path and he will try to uh, move to some other system we have a number of network attacks active or passive attacks so any attack may happen and anything may happen so that should not happen so the secure uh, uh, the communication system should be maintained in such a way that the uh, intended as source should transfer data to a intended server or a destination that's what the meaning delivery okay. next comes accuracy so what the accuracy the data that has been altered in transmission and the left are not corrected are unusable so what he is trying to tell so the data that you are transmitting like how you are transmitting to your friend so if it is altered by an attacker and if it is not recorrected then the data that is sent to the receiver is of no use at all yes so what i am trying to tell here the data that you have sent should be received by the receiver the correct data so the data integrity has to be maintained so you should not leak the data thereby attacker can easily modify the data and he can use it for his purpose in the future so that should not happen so that's what the meaning accuracy whatever the data that is sender is sending the same data we have to maintain to receive the at the receiver side so the data integrity has to be maintained then only we can say the communication system is okay the third very important characteristic is timeliness yes the system must deliver data in a timely manner data delivered later useless yes whatever the data that sender is sending by fixing the time stamp or a round trip time we call within that time only the data need to be received because sometimes what happens there may be a client server communication where the server is sending some otps to the client uh, with uh, uh, what i call that a lifetime of the password or otp so the data has to be received within a exact time so if the data is received after the uh, expiry of that uh, time or delay is maintained more then the data is of no use at all so that timeliness has to be maintained by the communication system and the last one is called as jitter jitter refers to the variation in the packet arrival time is very important so the packets that are arriving uh, should not be varied more so the, it should be uh, received in a uh, sequence order and also in a timely manner so sometimes you might have seen in Uh, television sometimes audio will come first next video will come or sometimes video will come and sometimes audio will come because that uh, uh, gives the, uh, the, the because of that uh, what happens there uh, there is some uh, variation in the packet arrival sometimes packet which has to come late may have delivered first or the packets that should come first should be delivered late thereby there may be some uh, what you call that variations in the packet arrival time and then uh, the uh, what you call the data what you call that sequence will not be maintained so in order to avoid that so the data transmission uh, sequence numbering all those should be maintained by using some uh, security uh, what you call that uh, uh, crc techniques uh, we have a number of techniques to maintain that so all those should be properly implemented in the uh, what you call that uh, communication system thereby easily you can attach uh, achieve the jitter so these are the four uh, basic fundamentals or the characteristics of a Uh, data communication so again i'm telling the delivery is whatever the uh, intended destination you are transmitting the data the data should reach to the same destination accuracy means whatever the data you are sending the same data need to be received there should be no modifications in the data means the data integrity need to be maintained and timeliness at what time we have fixed to receive the data the same time uh, has to be maintained and the lastly jitter there should be no packet variation in the arrival time okay it should be delivered in the same sequence order thereby you can easily get the correct data so this is these are the four fundamental characteristics 
सो होप्स यू एंजॉय द वीडियो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग एंड सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल फॉर मोर वीडियोज बाय